Turn to here and let's do the review of Earthrise Deluxe Class Cliff Jumper. So we have the new mode for Cliff, Cliff Jumper here. It's a red sport car. As you can see the vehicle mode from all the sides. And yeah, I quite dig this. You got, you got the line here. Clear blue glass, but somehow this is black. I'm not too sure about that part. Some clear blue. See on the hood of the car. See the vents. I think it's kind of similar. Is it a camera? I'm not too sure. But this, yeah, it is a nice vehicle. Quite small. As you can see, it fits the palm of my hand. And the wheels can roll pretty well. And this is comparison to Mirage. As you can see, a little bit off in scale, but I guess since Mirage is a bigger transformer already. And it's with Iron High. I think if Iron High is a earth vent, so this scale would be perfect. Because in fact van is bigger. And this is with Prime. As you can see this is a re really good scaling. Really good scaling here. And in fact, you can put actually put Cliff Jumper onto into Prime's trailer. He fits perfectly. Now I understand the reason for the trailer for being that hollow. That is to fit. And now the transformation, as you can see here. What you want to do is to untap this whole section and just remove it. Just keep it aside. Now I'll flip up this piece and then you also gonna try open this. Oh give me a second. It's kinda tight. Yeah. Just open it up, the whole body up. And lift this piece up that and put back the hood. As you can see this cliff jumper head. So open this two part. This is a pretty easy it's just gonna Swing up the two pieces here to form the shoulder of the torso. Flip back the hips. Rotate the arms. Like that. Now for the leg, actually for the feet, I'm sorry. I'm gonna form this piece here. And just bring it down like that. And close this piece in. Second one is the same. Bring it down. Uh, just tap it in like that. And just gonna rotate the whole hips. And for this piece here, a little bit apart from me, I'm gonna flip out this tab. There's a tab there. And tap it back in. To finish with the back. And here we go. And this is Cliff Jumper in his robot mode. And yeah, he's a very, he has a very simple transformation with a very G1 look, I must say. See the head here, a little bit closer. I mean like the red on the head is kind of in a different shade to, throughout the whole body, which is kind of strange to me. But you still got a lot of mechanical details, linings. And here you got the whole car hood here. You see the other clear blue, the leg. Nothing too much special if you are used to the G1 Bumblebee looks. And this is, can rotate. Rotate as well. And the bend here is quite impressive. For the leg, this is just red. Yeah, and it lacks the Autobot logo, which is kind of odd to me because why do they even try to do that? And this piece here just stay there. This piece here, as you can see, there's a lot of like the hole is black, and you have red foot. I mean, it's G1, so 
you can really complain about that. Accessories, He's, he packs a lot of accessories. So you got this piece here, it's basically a gun. And the one is nearly identical. So you got him dual wheeling. And you got this, uh, I guess it's a long gun or something, some sort. And put it onto the back and forward like so. Yeah, so he got a quite a big gun for a small guy. And this piece can combine and form a really big gun. It's like a uh, bazooka of some sort. Like that. Yes, yeah, it's like a rocket launcher now. As you can see, size comes in with it. This is with a masterpiece bumblebee. This is the MP45 bumblebee. I mean, like, they look the same. If he's yellow, I probably think he's from Mobius. Like, the proportion are the same. They all have bulky bodies and long black legs and colored feet. And yeah, this is like a, um, like an MP45 gamut and some size comparison with Mirage. As you can see, I told you from earlier, he's clearly smaller. This is with Iron High. Iron High is like nearly double in size, and this is with Siege Optimus Prime. He gets over the uh, knees a little bit. A Prime. And now I'm gonna transform him back to the car mode. And to be honest, this is a very simple. Transformer because he's basically like the G1 looking and then we have the mechanism from the uh, Masterpiece MD45 and I bet you money is that Hasbro in the future will release us an exact mode of this figure maybe a little bit different on the front of the car change the color to yellow and call it Bumblebee it's exactly what will happen so yeah, that concludes today's review my friend, thanks for watching and be sure to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel in the case you haven't and anything else, follow my Instagram, that's where I do my updates and everything, I'll leave the link in the description below, see you all, Tonton out.